Okay, this is already the freaking highlight of my day. Hi. <laughs> it, it's amazing. There's a baby goat involved. The cutest Indian children ever. We have camels. It's amazing. I love it here. I don't want to leave. I want to take baby goats with me. No, actually I want to just stay here and cuddle with baby goats and these wonderful children. <laughs> We're going to buy them biscuits right now. Just bought the kids some cookies and I'm changing money so I can give each like one or two rupees because they are so freaking adorable. Such a cliche Western tourist mental breakdown. And not because I feel sad for these children. They don't go to school, they grow up here and they will probably um, be doing what their parents are doing. And actually why I'm having such a mental breakdown is because every time I come to India, I see how little you need to be happy. I'm sorry. <laughs> My guide is looking, what's wrong with you? <laughs> it's just such, I don't know, it's so, it's, it makes an impact to see how little you need to be happy. And I, I, like some Westerners, they come here to educate the children and they want them to go to school, but <laughs> some Western children are, they have everything and they have all the education and they're so unhappy. <laughs> So this might even be a better life than having everything. I'm sorry. These are snake tracks and they are in those holes and they come out and it's really hot. No vegetables and panchati, right? <laughs> that was a wonderful nap and we are going to continue now to our sleeping place. Okay, let me do a little voice over just to be able to talk to you. So this is our new campsite and we are joined by two Japanese girls. Another beautiful sunset coming up. Cue music. 